everybody, Emil here from Bullet Motorsports. Today we have a 1999 Ferrari 550 Maranello. It's finished in Giallo Modena with Cuyo interior. It's got 26,401 original miles. It's a 5.5 liter V12 matted to a gated six speed manual producing 485 horsepower with 419 foot pounds of torque. For more information and an entire gallery, click the link below. And if you like the things you see on our screen, like and subscribe so we can keep making cool stuff. Let's get started. Let's talk about this exterior. I'd give this a nine out of 10. The Giallo Modena paint just shines so beautifully. All the lines, all the panels, everything is straight as an arrow. There's no visible dings or dents that would be obviously very unappealing on something like this. It does have a set of 255-40 and 295-35 18 tires that have about 95% tread on them. And aside from that, you can't get a better example of what a 1999 Ferrari 550 Maranello should look like. So let's take a look inside. This Cuyo interior has been meticulously well kept. The dash hasn't began to turn to bacon like some of these Ferraris do when you leave them out in the sun. Steering wheel's in great condition. All the lights, all the gauges work. The vents aren't chipping or cracking. All the buttons click firm like they're supposed to. All the lights turn on in the cabin. The driver's side seat does have a little bit of wear on the bolster from getting in and out. So does the shifter, but this car has over 20 years of service, so it can be expected. The seats are in immaculate condition. There's no getting from getting in and out. On the passenger side, carpets are great. This is a two-seater, so there's no rear seats, but the rear deck looks great. Straps are in great condition. And um, let's take a look under the hood where things really matter. Let's talk about under the hood. 5.5 liter naturally aspirated V12 matted to a six speed gated manual. This is actually the last six speed V12 that Ferrari produced. This particular example has a tick over 26,400 miles and it's just been meticulously well kept. All the insulation, all the coatings, all the plastics are still in very, very good condition. Exactly how you would want your example of a 550 Marinello to look. The Tipo F133 engine produced 485 horsepower and 419 foot pounds of torque. And let me tell you something, this thing at higher premiums, it just sings so beautifully. Um, let's take it for a ride. All right guys, so this is where I sign out and pass it over to John for the driving part. But before we do that, like and subscribe below so we can keep making cool content and we can keep putting my face on the screen. See you guys later. Right now, what we're gonna do is take it for a test drive on Marina Mile, let you guys see some beautiful shots while I talk about the interior. Interior is extremely nice. Your power windows work as they should. There are no check engine gauges, illuminated. Uh, temperature is slowly rising. We have full tank of gas. Air conditions, ice cold. You do have a uh, radio here that does operate. I'm gonna keep it off. Nothing sticky on the ashtray. It's just beautiful. And the best part about this one they actually tested the 550 in 98, 100 miles at 190 mile an hour average. And that's documented. So if you go on Wikipedia, you'll be able to see that. It does zero to 60 in 4.4 seconds, zero to 109.8 seconds, I believe. So under 10 seconds going to 100 miles an hour. The crazy part is the top speed is 199 miles per hour. So that's pure performance coming from a V12 made it to a gated six speed manual transmission. And I love the ratios for these. I think second gear is 3.15, which makes it extremely fun. Steering is very responsive. And by the way, we just put a brand new set of tires on it in between our opener of the video to what we're doing right now. So you have a brand new set of tires. We have the documents from Tire Rack, the installation, also, brand new set of fuel pumps were installed and everything was gone through. We also have compression readings that are going to be listed in the gallery below. Seats are very comfortable. The power seats operate. Uh, air conditions blowing cold and that's very, very nice. Oh my God, it sounds so good. Listen to that V12. We're only at 4,000 RPMs. This thing revs to 8,100 RPMs. So buttery smooth. The suspension feels so good. Fourth gear, no issues. We'll see if the clutch slips. Sixth gear, giving it gas, no slippage. It's so much torque from that V12. It's actually accelerating. Normally you'll have a little bit of a bog. Unbelievable piece. Once again, if you guys have any questions about this ride, or if you want to see additional photos like underside shots, 
or a comprehensive uh, documentation list, you're able to click on the link below that'll have everything you need. I just love how it feels. Right now I'm in fourth gear, it's just perfect. Turn signals are working. We're gonna jump on to 595, go to university and just turn around. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this content. If you guys like this type of footage, please be sure to like and subscribe because that makes all the guys here on the team extremely happy and it makes us strive for more. So we're gonna get more camera equipment the whole nine yards to allow you guys to have these enjoyable test drives. I'm in fifth gear right now. The new tire, so originally we actually did the test drive and it had tires from 2000 and I think 13. And you could feel the, the flat spots in them. Now, it's extremely nice, no issues. It's exactly what it's supposed to be. And hopefully the next caretaker will appreciate that we actually brought it there. We were able to get it serviced and it's ready to go. I believe they did the belts in 2008 and the mileage would be probably 200 miles before. So if you want to do that, you can do that as well. They did inspect it and they said everything looked fine. Oh my God, it feels so good. <laughs> Listen to the horn, it's amazing. Oh, it just feels so good. Right now we are at 4,000. Listen to the note change. Oh my God, I'm in love. What I'll do is once I turn around here on University, I will uh, go through the gears gradually. Right now we're getting artistic outside shots, so that's why you're not seeing me go sporting through the gears. You do have trash control. You also have a sport mode, so you can click that and it'll go into uh, probably different calibration. Uh, traction control is here. You have your lights, your trunk release, your fuel release. Oh, you can feel the complete difference once you put it in sport. It's much more responsive. Let's we'll see what this thing will do. Oh my God, yes. It is so smooth. And the power delivery is just perfect. I'm in love with it. If you guys have any questions, give me a call, 954-363-2261. Music to my ears. Music to my ears. 